The Vision Help Group um, to me is a group of uh, eye doctors who look at more than eyesight. One of the challenges that we have as developmental optometrists is conveying the incredible amount of scientific literature that's coming out in regards to the brain's relationship with vision. So often the individuals that we are describing are not able to obtain the care simply because they haven't heard about vision therapy. So one of the biggest challenges we have is, is to educate other professionals and the public as to the important role that vision plays in learning and a person's perception of themselves and someone's social life and professional life. Well, too many doctors, for example, uh, eye doctors look at two eyeballs walking into the office instead of somebody who has uh, problems. Because there's so much that can be done and there's just such a senseless struggle they don't have to just go around living with their condition. It's finding solutions for what I consider to be fairly simple issues and seeing the changes that we make on a daily basis that literally change lives and changes the course of these kids' lives in their future. No question about it, when we do our progresses and, and we see how the child or the adult has made tremendous improvements, and then when we're, we're able to do that, really gives you a good feeling. I think that's what keeps me going. The most fulfilling thing that I get from the work that we do um, is really just being able to help others to, to reach their um, highest potential, to make their life easier. Uh, information is coming in, as we all know, at such a rapid uh, rate. It's so compressed, it's so uh, content rich that the brain's capacity to contend with that and filter it and organize it is in large part the responsibility of the visual system. Among our greatest challenges have always been public awareness of what we do, how what we do in developmental vision is different from, let's call it conventional or traditional eye care. In 20 years from now, I would hope that people will look at the Vision Help Group as a place to go for vision information or information on how vision affects people on a daily basis and how we can help patients to obtain the care that they desperately need. Whether they be our website, blogs, Facebook page, advocacy in general, we want our message to be heard so that people know how to help their children.